Hey guys, welcome back. Dark War 57 here. And today, we're continuing on another episode of Sky Factory 2. Now, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I am so sorry to all of you who thought, who actually knew what to do. Um, the charger, <laughs> I couldn't figure it out. I was trying to throw them at it and everything, and I couldn't figure it out. Yeah, I figured it out about two seconds after I ended the episode. You just right click. You literally just right click with the crystal, and there you go. You got yourself a charged. So, yeah, that's how, that's pretty much how that works. So, um, also, if you remember, since I got that working, uh, there wasn't much to build. I already had the energy acceptor was like about done, like right there after I finished the charge, that was done. And then I already had the ME drive, and I figured out all you need besides those two things is a terminal, and that's pretty much it. So, I built it. Yeah. So. ME drive, which we already had. This was already almost done in the last episode, so. And then I had an ME cable when I pressed B. I had this ME, the two ME cables from that one crafting recipe of the ME drive. So I used one, and now I have the terminal. So yeah, it wasn't even that hard to make, but. So yeah, I'm pretty much ready. All I have to do is power it up. And I increased our power system. Yes, so I almost doubled the amount of lava uh, crucibles by basically filling. I realized I could actually fill in the middle of these, and it would save me blazing pyruthium because I would use uh, I could use it more efficiently because it flows um, I could fill these in so except I only had I put five more and I filled this all in and I actually did make two more buckets of blazing pyruthium so there's some in the middle and the ends now uh, so yeah it's a lot more efficient and we're one crucible away because I, I actually built four at first and it was still losing power very slightly <coughs> thank you bless you bless me bless you. how do you say bless myself Excuse me, excuse me, there we go. So, uh, it's gaining power uh, slightly by one crucible, so I added five, and then as soon as I added that fifth, it started gaining power. And if it's essentially, once it gained full power slowly, uh, then it, it was using the buffer, so eventually the lava started building up, so it's full. Uh, just by one crucible, though, it seems like I have a lot of extra power. Really not, I have barely enough to actually keep over even. So, um, the ME system will probably just make that difference and make it go down a bit. So hopefully we can do that. But I did get some more Vibrant Alley and stuff, so I can actually craft the cables to power it up. Okay, so I got uh, the Vibrant Alley, and then I got our Conduit Binders right here. Bam! So we got 25 of these cables, which should be plenty. Uh, so let's pull those out, and let's do this. So I want to wire it up over that. Perfect. So um, let's go like this, all the way up. Uh, oh, it's a slab. Get it over this. Yes, I believe we can. Uh, okay, let's just put it over that. Um, I'm gonna do this like so, uh, like so, like so, and there we go. Let's bring it over. Okay, so right here, and then just wire it in the top. So, bam. Bam, bam. There we go. Uh, in and out. So is it on? Uh, I think device online. Okay. But um, the thing that we need to craft as well is the drive. So we can't actually put anything in it until we get drive. So it's not completely done. But uh, as you can see, it's online. We can actually search and it's bright and everything is good. So I'm going to actually, I think I'm actually going to disconnect this because it's probably taking a lot of power. Yeah, that's taking, oh wait, no. Oh, it's gaining power still. I think it was just the startup cost. Yeah, it looks like it was just the startup cost to start it, so I guess we could leave it running. It doesn't make a difference. So, um, yeah, uh, basically we need to make those things. So, let's look it up. One uh, K. One K uh, store. I saw it earlier. It was really easy. I just wait, wanted to wait for it. So, one K uh, store itself. So, quartz glass, which is easy. Redstone iron, and that is some logic processors and just some normal service quartz. Easy. So logic processors, like let's make like four, just because. Uh, so printed circuit that's inscriber logic press with gold. So we'll press with B. Now let's get our inscriber logic press. Uh, inscriber logic press one. And you have to do them one at a time for some reason. It's just it's a little picky like that. Uh, so like that. Check that out. We can actually let them stack up over there. It's just you have to put the gold in one at a time. So that's two three and four okay we're good uh, so 
I believe we need the inscriber silicon press now. And we need to take this out, put that in there, and do the inscriber silicon. Uh, we need to make four of those as well, and then we combine those with a redstone, I think. Actually, I don't know if that needs a redstone. I think it does. I'm pretty sure. Uh, so, there we go. And let's go grab our redstone once that's finished. And we'll be good. Okay, so, let's grab a redstone. Oh, yeah, we made it over uh, two stacks of redstone. We're getting that redstone up. So, I figured out it was way easier just to do it like this because it stacks better. It actually sorts better by itself. And um, also, it just saves space because it looks less, looks like it has more space. Uh, so, yeah, let's put that there. And then we need that there, that there, that there. There we go. So, we're making that. Okay. Like so, like so, like so. Okay. This takes a while because you have to do it all singularly. I don't know how you'd automate this because you have to do it like in all these different slots. I guess top, bottom, and side equal these. Or, I don't know. Yeah, probably side and then if you pull out the side then it actually um, takes it from the output. It's probably, so there's got to be a way to figure it out. There's got to be a way to automate this, so. Okay. And bam, four logic processors. Okay, so make this. We need four of the storage units, so just 16 redstone and 16 uh, whatever that other stuff is. I've got uh, crystal stuff. Um, mm. Get over, get over. One, two, three. Okay. And then upstairs. Let's go. Uh, 16, one, two, three, four, five. We're actually running out of these. We're, we're cutting them close here. I actually need to sift some more sand. Oh, wait, what am I doing? Uh, okay. So. If it was like this, like this, and like this. Oh, uh, there we go, and there we go. There we go. Four 1K ME things, storage cells, and then um, our storage components. Okay, so quartz glass. We have one, uh, but we're going to need eight, so it's an even crafting recipe. So uh, to make it mix four, I believe, yeah, so we need eight glass and the surface quartz dust, no problem to us. So, oh, eight of that, so a cobblestone. Actually, no, I think we have one spare piece of glass, so seven. Uh, there we go. So, okay. We need to make a new hammer right here. I figured out that we actually can make the, um, a Botania hammer. I don't know if it's better, I'm guessing it is, just because it's using good mana steel. So we make it with, uh, Let's look it up. X asterisk. X asterisk. Uh, right there. Man of Steel. This is made from living wood. Oh, crap. Never mind. I have to do some stuff to get that. I know what I have to do, but it's. I don't want to do that now, so never mind. But oh, we'll just make another iron one, I guess. Uh, let's see. We have plenty of iron, so it's really no problem making iron hammers now. I mean, it's really no difficulty like whatsoever. It's really no hassle at all. Uh, to actually, it's definitely worth it. I mean, wait, did I turn on my volume? Yeah, I did. I was like, my, my, everything sounds kind of quiet to me. Okay, um, so, smell that up. That should be almost perfect. Okay. So, we're good. Uh, wait, what is that? Did I press something? That's new. I didn't even see that. That's sad. Um, Oh, okay, that was weird. Um, okay, that was new. I didn't even notice that. That's pretty sad that I, my, I, I seriously could not notice that. That was that was pretty sad. Okay, uh, so two crafting recipes. So that's uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, ten. Sort that up and go up. Uh, grab that. Perfect. And like so. Three, four, and like that. TNT, that. Okay, so we need uh, 1k. That is that. Uh, we need uh, 12 redstone, and we got the rest iron. Okay, so 12 redstone, 3, 1, two. Well, that redstone went out the door quick. That's why it's a good thing we're making it so quickly because it just flies out the door. Okay, what were we doing? We were doing, okay, so like this. 
this, and then like so, and like so, and like so. Perfect. Four 1K drives, better than chests. Bam, 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 bam. And I wonder if that takes more power. I realize it's going to take a lot of power when we actually start putting stuff into it. But I think we have a working ME system now, so we can actually throw all our crap into here. So let's just, uh, I think you hold, yeah, spacebar and just throw it. I'll get it all later. I'll get my normal stuff. I just, I just want to throw everything in there. So we can actually do this now. Let's grab everything. Uh, we're not going to put all the dust in there because that's going to take way too much storage. We'll have to get like a 32K at least for that. Uh, take all that. Okay. Uh, I think we can actually take all like the dust and the, gra the gravel stuff because that's separate stuff. And I think that's going to take up too much space, but we'll do that in a sec once we actually throw everything in there. Uh, okay, so it's working. Yeah. So, um, let me take this dirt, I guess. Uh, there we go. I always try to press E to get out of there, and it's like, gosh dang it. Ugh, I got it wrong. Oh, oh, where am I? Okay, oh my gosh. This thing is so bad. Okay. How are we doing? Uh, we're only fill up one. Wow, that's surprising. It's actually lasting a lot longer than I was expecting. Okay. Uh, okay. Bam. This is amazing. I love this. This is what I've been looking forward to for so long. And I thought it was going to be terrifying, but it's actually not as hard as I expected it to be. There we go. And, oh my god, it's amazing. We've only filled up two. We're halfway there. Okay. So, you're empty. Oh, no, you're not empty. Uh, you're empty. You're empty. You're empty. That was a lot of stuff that we just cleared out. And it's not even close to full. That's amazing. It's, yeah, it's not, it's a little bit more than halfway full. And we still have all this, this plenty of space. So now we don't even need that those chests up there. Let's just get our axe back, actually. Let's get our decent our normal stuff back, so. Uh, uh, what was it? Cutlass? Oh, axe. Um, just look through. It's not like it's too hard to find. Uh, we need our, okay, we need our hammer. We need our, our, uh, we don't need that thumb and hoe. Uh, oh, right here, the grinder. I forgot it's going to go by names. Thalmium pickaxe, like so, bow, arrows, and what else? It seems like we have pretty much. Let's get some iron on us. Let's keep that stack of iron and a little bit of gold, just because we always need that. Uh, we could actually keep, I don't have any redstone in here, but we could keep a stack of redstone on us because we're always running for it. Um, okay, so we're good. It looks like we have literally everything, like pretty much everything we own in here now. So that's amazing. Look at that. We need a crafting terminal eventually though, because I'd like to have one of those. It'd be a lot easier to craft stuff. So let's keep like 57 redstone on this just because we always need it. So there we go. Iron hammer. Uh, like so. There we go. So let's go upstairs and break all these. Awesome. Cool. And then pickaxe for you. Cool. Throw all these chests downstairs. And awesome. So how's our power doing? Because we threw a ton of stuff into there. We're still good. It barely costs any RF to run this ME system. Just because it's really basic. But it's amazing. It still works. All The only thing it prevents by not having the controller is I can't do automatic crafting yet, which that would still take a lot of resources and a lot of time to do. Actually, it wouldn't take too many. I think we actually get that. Um, so yeah, that's amazing. Awesome. So I think we should start working in the way of getting our ores to process themselves. So we're gonna need automatic crafting tables for that. And we're gonna need some this dust going and turning into gravel and then pumping into here, this thing, and then somehow automatically coming out of here, probably with autonomous activators and getting automatically taken out. So oh god, but I just realized we're gonna to have to have a seared tank for everything. Okay, let's start with the basics. Um, okay, so let's have this automatically craft into ore gravel. So we're gonna need automatic crafting tables. Tick. Crafting table. Automatic crafting table. Uh, crafting table, crafting table, crafting table, crafting table. Doesn't look like we actually have automatic crafting tables. Um, hmm. 
could we use the MU system for that? I think we can. If the problem is, it would need to be infinite, and we need to order up stuff in the MU system. Huh. Uh, what happens if I just take the stuff itself and put it in there? It doesn't smell like I thought. Okay. So we need to figure out a way to make this all work. Um, if you guys can help me, that would be awesome, but I feel like no one's going to know what either. Okay, so, it's some lava. Looks like it's all being used, like, exactly. So, yeah, pretty much exactly. Um, that's okay. Oh, bucket, 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 that's going to be awesome. Bucket, thank you. Uh, get a bucket of lava out of you. No. Well, uh, okay. We are going to need. What do we need? Um, hmm. I'm not sure. What do we need? Uh, well, we could wire up. Oh, we need more cables for that, though. We used quite a bit of our cables. I think we only have like five left. Uh, ah, damn it. It's so hard. What do I do? I'm trying to think of ways to do this, but there's not many. <sighs> okay. I have an idea. Um, not for that, but for something else. We can um, you make an anvil, because I have one, there's one of those. So let's make an anvil real quick. And what we'll do is then we'll enchant our armor with those haste books. One, to clear out our enemy system a bit. And two, because I kind of want to run faster. So yeah, let's do that. Uh, just because that would be awesome. So haste books, haste books, haste books, right there. Haste one. So let's take two of those and see if we can give ourselves haste two. Let's put this, I guess, right here. Okay. Like so, haste two. And then, can we enchant our pants? But I think we need to make better pants first. I think we have a spare pair of iron pants. I think we can make dark boots. Dark pants. So let's take this, let's melt those down. And I think we can make dark pants with those. So, alloy smelter. Okay, there we go. So we'll make dark pants in a sec with the haste too. That will be awesome. I don't really think we need dark. Oh god, it's gonna take a while. That's fine. But um, yeah, I really. C if you guys could know any way, or I'll have to probably look it up. But um, yeah. Um, if you guys know any way that's definite, then please tell me because I really need this to be able to do this. But for now, we we our next goal is to try to get. The grinder powered by with the uh, this generator. All of this is run off one generator. It's amazing, but um, with that generator and also coming exporting stuff back here, we'll need a lot of ME cables for that. Though actually, no, we don't need ME cables. We can hmm, we can just do normal cables, and we'll bring it into a chest right here, and that can be pumped in. So we don't because ME cables are harder to make than other cables. That item conduit, so we can do that. That's easier. Okay, how's our dark boots stuff going? 60%. Okay, so, awesome. That's our plan for that. And then what do we do besides that? Oh, wait, let's check the board. Uh, there. Okay, more efficient. Lab generators, more crucibles. I think we've gotten that out of the way. Uh, wire up the mob grinder, ME system. Done. Okay, so we literally, all we have to do is wire up the mob grinder now. Uh, I'll try to think of some more things to actually prioritize with food as well. Uh, big potatoes. Thank you. We need, uh, we need to figure out some more things to prioritize. Uh, oh, yeah. Automatic ore processing. Oh. Or processing. There we go. Okay. Automatic ore processing. That's all I can think of right now. Keep those on us. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much all I can think of. So we'll wait for these dark boots, uh, second pair of dark boots to finish getting turned into dark steel so we can make some dark pants. And I think that's what they go on. If not, we still have the third pair of dark boots to put them on just in case. Uh, so yeah. Yeah, that's good. Uh, we can actually make some more experience things because we were gathering a lot and it's kind of inefficient to use level 30 levels to combine stuff. So I guess we could try that. Maybe we still have some iron bars. Uh, so some obsidian, uh, uh, XP, uh, XP tank, liquid XP tank. Oh, it's glass panes and obsidian. 
Uh, glass panes, glass panes. I'm stupid. We have everything in the new system. <laughs> so he's doing for upstairs. Okay, uh, glass. Cool. Make uh, some of those. Obsidian. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. There we go. We can make quite a bit actually. Bam. Uh, okay. So trains coming. I think. I can't really tell. I think that's a train. Just a warning. Uh, yeah, train. Okay. Oh, yeah, that made it a lot bigger. Okay. Let's fill this thing up and keep our guess some levels just in case. Oh, we can always get back right now. Let's fill it up. And hey, Pigman, you're, you're being here. You've are you been here for so long, man. I've just been chilling here. What's up? I'm just doing nothing. Yeah. Yeah. That's all you're doing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, uh, and 93, 94. Okay, let's do this. I kind of want to run faster because even with the jetpack, we can't really go fast, so I kind of want that. So let's craft a pair of dark steel pants. Awesome. And let's test this out. So I feel like haste would be on the legs. Uh, that makes sense, sort of. Uh, haste 2. Is it not on the legs? It is, in fact, on the boots. Okay, so I was wrong. It is, in fact, on the boots. So. Four. Okay. Go. So it is in fact on the boots. Good thing it corrected me. Case two. So let's put those on. I guess we can put the dark leggings on just because. So how fast do we run? Oh, I guess that's a little bit faster. Yeah, I guess that, that's a that's a noticeable upgrade. I was expecting a little bit faster, but I mean, can't complain. I believe the dark pants actually have a like a thing you can add to them to make you go faster, but. Yeah, so that's good. We're going faster now, but yeah, that's pretty much all I have for this episode. Please tell me how to automatic craft. I'm going to look it up myself probably, but I might forget, so please help, maybe. So, thank you guys for watching. Be sure to leave a like down below if you enjoyed. Subscribe to my channel, Dark57, as well. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram in the description below, and I will see you all next time.